confronting a superpower. I think it reflects the moment that we are in around the world and, and most recently here in our own country. We are in a moment when we have, most of us, been uh, amazed and impressed by the actions of um, large numbers of very young people, most recently responding to the tragedy in Parkland, Florida, and stepping up to sort of lead our nation and our society in some pretty profound and much needed conversations having to do with school safety and gun violence and how we tackle those issues. And I know for myself, I have really on so many occasions been thunderstruck by their determination, their eloquence, their strength in, in sort of stepping forward uh, to speak out and to lead in this conversation. Tonight, you're going to see the story of a young man who in some ways I think of as almost a precursor to what we're seeing now in this country. Joshua Wong, when he was Oh, it's almost unbelievable to say, but was 14 years old, became the animating force behind a, a powerful movement in Hong Kong, initially a movement of students focused on, on protecting and defending their educational system from uh, a very insidious propaganda effort from um, the Chinese government, and then more broadly became a, a, a movement to fight for democracy and for the independence and for the way of life of, of the homeland, the vibrant island homeland that he, he loves so much. Um, it is truly a David and Goliath story. And uh, Joshua um, is, and, and his sort of small band of Jedi Knights really uh, have thought of themselves as engaged in, a, in an epic battle against their own empire. Uh, Teenager versus Superpower has received wide acclaim winning the Audience Award at the Sundance Film Festival and many, many other accolades. <coughs> Following the film, we will have the special opportunity to discuss not only the film, but broader human rights issues and challenges that, ch that China poses with two exceptional guests. So I'd like to invite you now to please enjoy the film. We will be back at the end, and, uh, and I look forward to a conversation with all of you.